Rural areas on both sides of the Carolinas, they are booming after years of decline. That's thanks to a remote work and affordable living at this point, but the increase in growth could pose a challenge for communities that are not ready for it. WCNC Charlotte's Tradisha Woodard shows us how some areas are working to expand amid the growth. Lots of developments are cooking up in rural counties ahead of the growing population. We're trying to stay ahead of it. This comes after data from the U.S. Census Bureau highlighted consistent population declines for rural areas from 2010 to 2020. But new data from the North Carolina Rural Center shows a potential shift from the decade-long trend. We were a county at really at 96,000 and we're projected to be on our path to 136,000. And also you can just tell the number of rooftops. People can see the buildings, the housings, the apartments that are going up. In Lancaster, they say they've already approved more than 5,000 housing units over the next three to seven years to accommodate the growth. They say they're also working to improve other things like infrastructure and amenities. We just did a new strategic plan that's looking three to five years. Infrastructure is a key part of that. Public safety is a key part of our um, strategic plan. Over in Rowan County, they're also working ahead of the growth. They say right now they're tracking residential developments to make room for the crowds. So whether it's apartment complexes, mixed use, or um, housing subdivisions, we are starting to track that because we need to know what's happening, where it's going. So when people reach out to us and they're looking for new developments like that, we know where to send them. They say they're also prioritizing expanding employment opportunities and have landed two massive projects that will bring thousands of jobs to the area another effort to encourage growth and enhance the quality of life. We are excited to welcome them to our community. Tradisha Woodard, WCNC Charlotte.